Okay. Let us sit comfortably. Spine straight, palms open to the ceiling, eyes closed. Take a deep breath in and breathe out slowly. Take one more deep breath in and breathe out slowly. Let us chant Om three times, bringing your fingers to Chin Mudra. Breathe in for Om. Oh. Oh. Slowly join your palms together. Let us tell a small prayer. Oh, Sahana Bhavatu, Sahana Bhunatu. Sahaviryam karavavahai Tejasvinavadi tamastumavid vishavahai Om Shanti 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 Slowly rub your palms, top it on your eyes, and look in through the gaps of the fingers. Open your eyes with a beautiful smile. Okay, wow. So, in Ikwandi, we will do Nadi Shodhana Pranayama. We'll do Nadi Shodhana Pranayama. So, left hand, chin mudra, or prana mudra. Last two fingers, touching fingertips, touching the tip of the thumb. Yes, that uh, keeping it on the thighs. Right hand in Vishnu Mudra or Nasadra Mudra. Vishnu Mudra, right, you will use your thumb to close your, close your right nostril and ring finger to close your left nostril. We can also use this stretching our first two fingers and keeping our um, middle finger or the index finger on the eyebrows, uh, eyebrow center like this. This also we can do. Whichever is comfortable for you, you do that. Okay? So closing your left nostril, breathe in from the left. Close the left nostril and exhale from the right. Inhale from the right. Close the right nostril and exhale from the left. Okay, now we'll do with counts, okay? We will inhale for a count of six and try to exhale for a count of 10. Try for 10. So inhale for a count of six. One, two, three, four, five, six. Close, exhale, right. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, Eight, nine, ten. Inhale right. One, two, three, four, five, six. Close. Exhale left. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Inhale left. One, two, three, four. Five, six, close, exhale, right. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Inhale, right. One, 
टू थ्री फोर फाइव सिक्स फ्लोर सिक्स से लेफ्ट वन टू थ्री फोर फाइव सिक्स सेवन एट नाइन टेन इनके लेफ्ट वन टू थ्री फोर फाइव सिक्स क्लोज एक्सेल राइट वन टू थ्री फोर फाइव सिक्स सेवन एट नाइन टेन इनहेल राइट वन टू थ्री फोर फाइव सिक्स क्लोज एक्सेल लेफ्ट वन टू थ्री फोर फाइव सिक्स सेवन एट नाइन टेन इनके लेफ्ट वन टू थ्री फोर फाइव सिक्स क्लोज एक्सेल राइट वन टू थ्री फोर फाइव सिक्स सेवन एट नाइन टेन इनके राइट वन टू थ्री फोर फाइव सिक्स क्लोज एक्सेल लेफ्ट वन टू थ्री फोर फाइव सिक्स सेवन एट नाइन टेन इनके लेफ्ट वन टू थ्री फोर फाइव सिक्स क्लोज एक्सेल राइट वन टू थ्री फोर फाइव सिक्स सेवन एट नाइन टेन इनहेल राइट वन टू थ्री फोर फाइव सिक्स क्लोज एक्सेल लेफ्ट वन टू थ्री फोर फाइव सिक्स सेवन एट नाइन टेन लास्ट राउंड इनहेल लेफ्ट वन टू थ्री फोर फाइव सिक्स क्लोज एक्सेल राइट वन टू थ्री फोर फाइव सिक्स सेवन एट नाइन टेन इनहेल राइट वन टू थ्री फोर फाइव सिक्स क्लोज एक्सेल लेफ्ट वन टू थ्री फोर फाइव सिक्स सेवन एट नाइन टेन देन स्लोली रिलैक्स ओके चिटी ओके सो दिस वन नाइन राउंड சொல்லுங்க சித்தி நீங்க மியூட்ல இருக்கீங்க சித்தி ஜாயின் பண்ணிருக்காங்க அன்மியூட் மியூட் கேக்கல ரொம்ப நாளைக்கு அப்புறம் ஜாயின் பண்ணிருக்கேன்னு சொல்ற ஆக்சுவலி அவங்க உமாக்காக நான் இன்னைக்கு வந்து ஃபுல்லா நான் பண்ணது வந்து ப்ரீ நேட்டல் திசிங் தான் ஓகே கொஞ்சம் அதனால கொஞ்சம் ஸ்லோவா இருக்கும் சரியா சரியா டைனமிக் எல்லாம் கிடையாது ஸ்லோவா தான் இருக்கும் சரியா அண்ட் இந்த மாதிரி ஒரு சின்ன ஸ்டூல் இருக்கா சித்தி இந்த ஹைட்டுக்கு ஒரு சின்ன ஸ்டூல் இருந்ததுன்னு வச்சுக்கோங்க வி வில் ட்ரை ஸ்டாண்டிங் அண்ட் பெண்டிங் ஃபார்வர்ட் எல்லாம் ஓ ஸ்டூல்ல இதுக்கு பதிலா நீங்க வந்து சேர் வச்சுக்கோங்க ஃப்ரண்ட்ல ம் சரியா ஸ்டூல் இருக்கு ஆ எதுனாலும் உங்களுக்கு அது வழக்க கூடாது தட்ஸ் ஆல் சரி சரியா ம் சரி ஸ்டார்ட் பண்ணலாமா ம் வார்ம் அப் எஸ் ஓகே ஓகே ஃபர்ஸ்ட் we will start with our neck சிதி உங்களுக்கு வலிக்குது நான் கஷ்டமா இருக்குன்னா ஸ்டாப் பண்ணிருங்க எப்பனாலும் ஓகே ஃபர்ஸ்ட் வி வில் ஸ்டார்ட் வித் அவர் நெக் சோ ब्रीத் இன் நெக் அப் லுக் அப் ब्रीத் அவுட் பிரிங் யுவர் சின் டு தி காலர் போ ब्रीத் இன் அப் ब्रीத் அவுட் bring your chin to the collarbone do it slowly 
Breathe in, neck up, look up. Breathe out, bring your chin to the collarbone. Breathe in up. Breathe out, bring your chin to the collarbone. Now we'll do from side to side. Breathe in, center, breathe out to the right, turn sideways. Breathe in, center, breathe out, left. Breathe in, center, breathe out, right. Breathe in, center, breathe out, left. Breathe in, center, breathe out, right. Breathe in, center, breathe out, left. Then slowly come back to center. Now we'll do just rolling like this. So bringing your chin to the collarbone. Roll, come up, look up. Then slowly come back. Chin to the collarbone, then look to the other side. Roll your neck, semicircle up, look to the right, then come down, chin to the collarbone, then look towards your left. One more time. Bring your chin down, chin to the collarbone, then slowly come to look towards your right. Then slowly come down and go towards the left. Look towards your left. Then slowly come back to center and slowly, slowly relax. Slowly relax. Now we will do for our hands. So taking your hands above at the shoulder level. Okay. Take your, bend your one hand and take it to the other shoulder blade like this. Yes, then keeping your hands at the elbow, try to push it back. Try to push it back like this. Try to push it back. Look forward. This gives a nice extension for the shoulder blades. Keep pushing and stay here. Stay here. One, two, three, four, five. Then slowly relax your hands. Now do the same thing on the other side. Bend your hand at the elbow level. Take your left hand to the right shoulder blade. Okay? Then take, bend this hand and push this hand behind. At the elbow, push it behind. Look forward and stay. Gives nice extension for our shoulder blades. Stay here. One, two, three, four, five. Then slowly relax, relax your hands. Now bring your fingers on the shoulder and bring the elbows together. Breathe in and breathe out. Breathe in and breathe out. Reverse, breathe in, breathe out. Breathe in, breathe out. Breathe in and breathe out and slowly relax, okay? These we can do for our shoulders and shoulder joints, okay? Same thing we can do for our wrist, keeping rotating our wrist like this. This is for our wrist and reverse rotation, reverse rotation, reverse rotation. This is for our wrist. Now for our whole hands, stretching your hand by the sides, Palms facing downwards. Slowly turn your palms up. Then slowly turn your palms down and come reverse up. Now move one hand up. The other hand let it remain. Then turn reverse up. These are for strengthening our hand muscles. Up, reverse up. Then up, reverse up. 
up, reverse up, alternate hand. And do this. This will, this will extend, uh, relax our hand muscles. Okay. Now, let us go for our body. Let us go to cat cow pose. Okay. Let us go to this position. This position. Chiti umlal panamudima. If suppose knee pain irundadna, nega vandu knee pain irundadna, pillow vach konga. Below your hand. Okay. This is very, very good for um, back pain release. This one is very good for back pain release. Coming like this, your shoulder and uh, wrist should be in one straight line and knee and hip should be in one straight line. If suppose there is a pain for the knees, you can keep a pillow below the knees. Okay? Nalla gap, take nalla gap between the legs. Now breathe in, arch your spine, look up. Breathe out, curve your spine, chin to the collar bone. Breathe in, arch your spine, look up. Breathe out, curve your spine, chin to the collar bone. Breathe in, arch your spine, look up. Breathe out, curve your spine, chin to the collar bone. Now what we'll do, we'll tuck our toes while breathing in. You tuck your toes like this and arch your spine. While breathing out, stretch your legs like this, ankle movement. Stretch your leg like this and curve your back. Breathe in, arch your spine, tuck your toes. Breathe out, curve your spine, stretch your toes. Breathe in, arch your spine, tuck your toes. Breathe out, curve your spine, change the collarbone, stretch your toes. One more time. Breathe in, arch your spine, tuck your toes. Breathe out, curve your spine and stretch your toes. Now come back to table. Now what you're going to do, you keep your... You keep your small stool here or if you are able to do, go like this. Go to one side. Go to one side like this. I'm walking my hands to one side. Yeah. Then I'm coming on my fingers and going down as much as you can. Go down as much as you can and stretch. I'm going to one side and stretching. Now I'm in the center. I'm walking my hands to one side. Then coming on my fingers, then moving down like this and staying here. Stay here as much as you can. You go and stay here. If you are able to bring your forehead to the mat, you can go. Otherwise, you can just stay here. Stay here. One, two, three, four, five. Then slowly come back. Slowly come back to center. Now walk your hands to the other side, one more side, and stretch. Come on your, come on your fingers, come on your fingers, and then bend. Go down as much as you can. Stretch and stay here. Stay here. One, two, three, four, five. Then slowly come back. Slowly come back to center. Now bend your elbows like this. And then just keep your head on your elbows. Stay here. Keeping your hands on, keeping your head on your hands and stay here. Stay here. Stay here for a couple of seconds. One, two, three, four, five. Then slowly come up, slowly come up to table. Slowly come up to stay table. And try to sit in Vajrasana, taking gap between the legs. Try to sit in Vajrasana with your toes together. Legs are bent. Your toes together, you will be sitting on your heels. If you are able to, try to sit. Otherwise, you can keep a pillow below like this also. You can sit like that. Vajrasana, sit in Vajrasana. Now, bend your, bend your elbow and 
See here. Now bending your elbow. Bend your elbow like this. Taking your hands behind. Taking your hands behind. Interlacing behind your head. And slowly move forward without bending your without curving, without curving. That's it. You're going to come up straight and bend forward, stretching your spine. Come up and then don't bend so much. You go this much only, stretching your spine. That's it. Up and go as much as you can slowly. Your spine should be straight. Up and then go straight forward, up and down. Vajrasana naturally keeps your spine erect, so we can go forward and back in Vajrasana. Just keep gap between the legs so that you will not feel strain for your stomach. Okay? Now, from here, come to kneeling down position. Come to kneeling down position and take your one leg forward like this. Take your one leg forward like this. Take your one leg forward like this. Yeah. Now straightening your hands up. Straight your hands up and stay here. Straight your hands up and stay here. Straight your hands up and stay here. One, two, three, four, five. Now what we will do in this condition, you are going to keep your right hand on the right hip left hand up and go to one side. Go to one side. One side like this. One, two, three, four, five. Then slowly come back to center and take your leg back. Now bring the other leg forward, other leg forward and raise your hands up. And stay here. One, two, three, four, five. Now bring your left hand on the left hip, right hand up, and go to the left and stay here. One, two, three, four, five. Then slowly come back to center. Slowly come back to center. Now what we will do, bend your right leg forward, okay, and stretch it, bend and stretch, bend and stretch. When you are stretching your leg, you can take support also, take support of your stool by the side like this, bending your leg and then stretch. When you are stretching your Toes are above. You are on your heels. Okay? Okay? Now, take it a little more further forward. Bend and stretch. Bend and stretch. You are not moving your legs. You are not moving your legs. For initially, you will be doing it. Bending and stretching. Now, go forward. Go forward. Your leg will remain the same. You will bend and stretch. No moving. This should not move. This leg should not move. You take support of your stool, keeping your hands, your leg will be same. Leg will be in the same position, little forward. Go little more forward. Yes, not yes. Now bend and stretch. Yes, super. Bend and stretch. Bend and stretch. Bend and stretch. Bend and stretch. Then bring this leg back. Now take the other leg forward. Little forward. Little forward. Now bend. Go forward. Then come back. Stretch your legs. Knee should be straight. Yes, super. Bend forward and stretch your legs. Yes, super. This is for our strengthening our leg muscles as well as the hip joints. Bend forward as much. Go only as much as you can, then come back. 
So bend forward, then slowly come back. Bend forward, and then slowly come back to center and take your leg back. And you can keep your hands on the stool or the this thing. Now do body circles like this. Do circling. Circling. Do body circles. Body circles like this. Then reverse. Reverse circling. Reverse circling. Keep to the left. Back. Right. Left, back, right. Your leg can be tucked or stretched. That is your option. You are concentrating on your body rotating. Okay? Now your stool is up like this. Take the support of the stool or whatever you are having. Then tuck in your toes. Come up and stay like a V. Your spine should be straight. Your spine should be straight. Stay here, stay here and start pedaling like this. You don't lift your leg. Instead of that, come on your toes and on your heels. Come on your toes and on your heels without lifting the leg up. Come on your toes and come on your heels. Toes, this is called as pedaling. Yes, super. Stretch, stretch and do that. Stretch and do that. Stretch and do. Okay. Then bring your both the legs little forward and stay here. Spine should be straight. Interlacing your elbows like this. Just do up and down movements. Just do up and down movements. Up and down movements. Spine should be straight, not curved. Up and down movements. Just up and down, then go to the left, up and down, then go to the right, up and down, then slowly come back to center, then slowly raise up, slowly raise up. Now what we will do? We will do with our leg, okay? We will do with our standing position. Take this, keep this as a support. Okay, now you're going to take gap between the legs. Your gait, as much gap, that much is good for your muscles. Okay, as much gap as you can, you can take. So see to that, your front leg is in line with the man. Back leg, 45 degrees, inward. Both will be inward towards the mat you will be going. Yeah, now what you're going to do? You are going to bend like this and slowly come up. Bend your knees for front knee forward and slowly come up. Widen your leg. That is very good for your childbirth. Widen your legs as much as you can. See, when I am bending, I am not moving like this. I am going this much, stretching my back leg. This will be 90 degrees vertical. Back leg should be stretched. That much you have to stretch your legs. Yes? Yes. Super. 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 Yes. This is how you have to do. Now bend as much as you can and raise your hands up and stay here. One, two, back leg, knees will be straight. Three, four, five. Then slowly come up. Knees are straight. Now what you're going to do, you're going to bring your hands forward, then make a fist and bring your hands back. Okay? Yeah? Take, a, take your hands up. Bend forward, knees forward. Bend forward, knee, knee bend. Yeah? Then make a fist and raise up, stretching your hands. Yeah, stretching your hands forward and back. Okay, we'll do it with breath. Breathe in up. Breathe out, down. Breathe in, come back. Breathe in up. Breathe out, down. Breathe in, pull. And come up. We can do it like this also. Breathe out. Breathe in. 
Breathe out, breathe in. Breathe out, breathe in. Breathe out, breathe in. Then slowly bring your leg back. Bring your leg back. If suppose you are feeling any pain in the hip, just do this rotation. One, two, three, four, five, six. Reverse. One, two, three, four, five, six. Now, let us do the same thing with the other leg, okay? Take the other leg back, okay? As much as you can go, as much as you can you go, uh, how much ever you are extending, that much it is good for our leg muscles, okay? Now bend the left leg forward and come back. Do it slowly as much as you can. Stretch and come back. Bend forward and come back. Your back leg little more back. Your back leg little more back. Yes. Then forward and back. Forward and back. Then go forward, straightening your hands up and stay here. One, two, three, four, five. Then come back. Now what you're going to do? Raising your hands up, bending forward, stretching your hands forward. Make a fist and then come back. Stretch your hands up, bend forward, no, sorry, knee forward, knees bend forward, stretching your hand, make a fist, then pull it back, okay? Stretching your hand up, stretching your hand forward, bend your knees forward, make a fist, and then bring it back, okay? Now we'll do only with our hands forward and back. Stretch your hands forward, make a fist, and pull back. So when you're pulling back, you're breathing in. Breathe out, stretch your hands, make a fist. Pull back, breathe in, breathe out. 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 Then slowly come back to center and bring your legs forward. Again, do the hip rotation. Again, do the hip rotation. Do the hip rotation. Four to five times in one direction and the other direction. One, two, three, four, and five. Then slowly come back to center. Slowly come back to center. This time, keeping your right leg forward, left leg to the left leg to the back. You want rest? Okay. Now taking your support with the stool. Take the support with the stool and raise your back leg. See here, I'm coming on my toes and coming down. Coming on my toes and coming down. Coming on my toes and coming down. On my toes and down. On my toes and down. This is for our back leg. Back leg coming on my toes and down. On my toes and down. On my toes and down. Then slowly bring this leg forward and take the other leg back. Other leg back. Front leg is slightly bent. Then come on your toes and down. 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 Then slowly bring the other leg forward. And slowly raise up. Slowly raise up. Now, we will do chair pose. This will give little pressure on the knees and the hips. If suppose your knees and hips are paining, take support of the actual chair itself while going down. Yeah? Otherwise, just bend. Keep pushing your hip down. Keep pushing your hip down. Your spine should be straight and your hands up. Your spine should be straight, your hands up. And stay here. One, two, three, four, five. 
Now bend your elbows, bring it and go to the side like this and come back to center, go to the right like this. Come back to center, go to one side, come back to center, go to the other side, come back to center and straightening up your hip. Okay, this movement will help your spine straight and your hip works on our legs and our hips. Okay. This is it. This is called a chair pose. You are both, both the, you should not move forward like this. Just like how you sit in the chair, you keep going down. Your lower leg should be straight. Your lower leg should be straight. Okay. Then come back to center. Then come back to center. Then straighten. Sit, stand straight. Stand, stand straight. Stand straight. Now, keeping your hands on the hip, bend your one leg and come one toe, heel on the other leg, heel on the other leg, toe, heel on the other leg, yeah? If suppose you are able to balance, then put it on your shin. If suppose you are not able to balance, you keep it down. If you are able to balance, put it on your shin and stay here, stay like this. If you are able to balance, take your hands up and stay here. One, two, three, four, five. Then slowly bring your legs down. If you are able to balance, put it little above, not on the, not on the knees. It should be either above or below. Yeah, it can be above, no issues. But if you are able to balance, only do this. Otherwise, don't do, you should not fall. Then slowly release your right leg. Do the same thing with the other leg. Your toes are on the ground and your heel is touching the other leg. Yeah? If you are able to balance, bring it to the shin and raise your hand up and stay here. This all will strengthen the leg muscles. One, two, three, four, five. If you are able to balance, then you can pick your leg up and go to tree pose. This is called as tree pose. One, two, three, balance, balance, four, five. Then slowly come back to center and slowly release your leg. Release your leg. Release your leg. Now we'll do the leg movements. Now we'll do the leg movements. Bending your right leg, if you are able to balance, take it to the right and come down. Bend forward, go to the right and slowly come down. Forward, right and come down. Forward, right and come down. Then go to the right, forward and come down. Right, forward and come down. Right, Forward and come down. Let us do with the same thing with the left leg. Forward, left and come down. 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 Now go to the left, forward and down. Left, forward and down. Left, forward and down. Left, forward, Left, forward, and down, and slowly relax. Now, what we will do? This we will do for our legs, hamstrings. Bending your one leg and holding like this, bringing your leg close to your buttocks, and just stay here. One, two, three, four, five. Then slowly release this leg. Bend the other leg, hold at your buttocks and stay here. One, two, three, four, five. Then slowly relax. Now what we can do? We can do one more thing. Bend your leg, kick your buttocks up and release. The other leg, bend, try to bring it close to your buttocks and release. Bend. Bring it close to your buttocks and release. 
the other leg and this will help in relaxing the hamstring muscles okay and it will release your leg pain one more thing is coming on your toes and down like this keep doing this coming on your toes and down coming on your toes one leg alternate it now you can do it with both the legs also coming on your toes and down 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 then slowly relax slowly relax relax now let us relax by let taking your legs little gap and raising your hands up and do nice shoulder rotations like this two three four five reverse one two three four Five and relax your shoulders, relax your hips, relax your hips, and then slowly coming to come to come down again, come down again, come to seated position if you can, come to seated position if you can. now stretching your leg legs forward like this stretch your leg forward take gap between the legs little as much as you can yeah then now your stool is there no forward keeping your stool by the sides slightly yeah you are going to stretch your spine okay no curving stretch your spine and bend forward like this stretch your spine and keeping your hands forward look forward and keep moving look forward and keep moving slightly okay and stay here stretch your spine and stay here 1 2 3 4 5 then do the same thing or with the other side other leg look forward and stay here 1 2 3 4 5 then slowly relax now we will do with bending of our legs bend your legs and take your hands back like this your spine should be straight okay your spine should be straight your hands are supported in the back your spine should be straight your legs are bent okay now take your one leg and keep it over the other thigh figure 4 yeah now just stay here this is very good for our tailbone just stay here 1 2 3 4 5 then slowly releasing this leg take the other leg up and stay here yes stay here 1 2 3 4 5 then slowly release your release your leg release your leg okay this is this we can do even lying down position also you can do just lying down and keeping your leg up this will gives the relaxation for your tailbone okay bringing your leg over the other leg and staying here let us do it one more time keeping your leg over the other stay here spine should be straight you are making a perfect straight yes 1 2 3 4 5 release this leg lift the other leg and keep it over the leg and stay here 1 2 3 4 and fall slowly release your leg slowly release your leg and slowly come to lying down position bending your knees like this slowly come to lying down position 
to one side. Keep a pillow below. Keep a pillow below above. For your upper body, keep a pillow. And for your legs also, you can keep a pillow. We will do some stretches for our legs before going for relaxation. So keeping your hands by this, if you suppose your neck is painy, you can stretch your hands and just lie down like this. Your legs are bent. Your legs are bent like this. Okay. Now we are going to just do a half butterfly, raising the leg up and bringing your leg together. Raising your leg up and bringing your legs together. Raising your leg up and bringing your legs together. Raising your one leg up. Yes, then bringing your leg together. Yeah. Now straighten and straighten the upper leg. Straighten the upper leg. Okay. Now raise your leg up and slowly bring it down. This also will strengthen your hip joints, leg muscles will get relaxed. Raise up and bring it down. Raise your leg up and bring your leg down. Raise your leg up and try to stay here. One, two, three, four, five. Then slowly come down. And now what you can do, you can also try to do circling like this. One, two, three, four. And five. Relax a bit. Relax a bit. And then do the reverse cycling. Go to the back. Do one, two, three, four, five. And then slowly bend your legs and relax. Bend your legs, legs and relax. These all will help in strengthening the legs leg muscles and it will help uh, for uh, relaxing this hip joints. When you are relaxing your hip joints, even the back pain will get relieved. That is the beauty of this side leg raises. Okay. Now slowly raise up and go to the other side. We'll do the same thing on the other side. Slowly raise up and bring your legs to the other side. Bending your legs, bring to the side like this slowly. And then slowly lie down. If suppose you are comfortable, you can keep your hands and your head up. Or you can stretch your hand and lie down on the head. Keeping your head on the hands. The upper hand can come in front of the chest. Okay, now let us do opening the leg up. Butterfly, half butterfly. And bring your knees together. Leg up, knees are bent up, half butterfly. Up and down. Up and down. Up and down. Up and down. Then slowly stretching your leg. Stretching your leg down and raise it up as much as you can. And then slowly bring your leg down. Raise your leg up as much as you can. And then slowly bring your leg down. Raise your leg up as much as you can. And then slowly bring your leg down. One more time, raise your leg up as much as you can and then slowly bring your leg down. Relax for some time. Now we will do circling. So raising our leg up, let us do rotations like this. One, two, three, four, and five, and slowly relax, 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 relax your legs. Now we'll do the reverse rotation, reverse. 
one, two, three, four, and five. And slowly relax, stretching your leg, relax. Last, we will raise and hold and then release. Raise your leg up, hold here, and stay here as much as you can. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and ten. Then slowly release your leg and bend your legs and relax. Just relax. Now relax, relax. Now keep as much pillow as you can in between the legs also. Keep pillow. Keep pillow, lying down on your side. Relax comfortably, as much comfortable as you can. Keep your legs, keep your, keep your legs and lie down. Lie down, we'll do relaxation for five minutes. Lie down. If you want, you can lie down on your chitti, you can lie down on your back. Uma, you lie down on your side. Keep enough pillows so that you are comfortable. Relax. 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 Let us do yoga nidra. Bring about an inner relaxation in the whole body. Concentrate on the body and become aware of the importance of complete stillness. Develop your awareness of the body from the top of the head to the tip of the toes and relax. Mentally tell the mantra Om. Om. Continue the stillness and complete relaxation of the whole body. Relax your whole body from the top of the head to the tip of the toes. Oh. Become aware of the fact of doing yoga nidra. At this moment, take a resolve or a sankalpa, a short positive statement. The resolve you make during yoga nidra is bound to come true in your life. Take a resolve and repeat it three times. Take a resolve and repeat it three times. Now we begin to rotate our consciousness, rotation of our awareness through the different body parts. Become aware of your right foot, right ankle, right chin, right knee, right hip, entire right leg, navel center, left foot, Left ankle, left shin, left knee, left hip, entire left leg, 
Bring your attention to the navel center, abdomen center, heart center, throat center. Attention on your right shoulder, right elbow, right wrist, right palm, entire right hand, throat center, left shoulder, left elbow, left wrist, left palm, entire left hand. Relax your throat center, chin, lips, nose, right cheek, left cheek, right ear, left ear, right eye, left eye, right eyebrow, left eyebrow, eyebrow center, forehead, top of the head. Relax your complete body. Become aware of your breath. Feel the breath flow in and out of your lungs. Now let us do some visualization. Try to visualize the named objects to the best of your ability. A burning candle. Snow-capped mountain. Temple at sunrise. Hear the temple bells ringing. Birds flying across the sunset. Grey clouds drifting across the sky. Stars at night. Full moon. Smiling Buddha. Waves on a deserted beach. Hear the pounding of the waves. Feel the gentle breeze from the sea. Watch the restless sea. Now it is time to recall the Sankalpa. Recall the Sankalpa and repeat that three times. Now relax all your efforts. Become aware of your natural breath. Your body is relaxed. Mind has also become calm and pleasant. Just stay there in silence for a few more seconds. slowly becoming aware of your surroundings. Start making gentle movements in your body. Slowly stretching your legs about, legs down, stretching your hands above your head. Slowly turn to one side and stay there for a couple of seconds. And with the support of the other hand, 
Slowly sit up, slowly sit up, slowly sit up with your eyes closed. In this calm state of mind, let us pray and bless this whole world, bringing your palms together. Om Sarve Bhavan Sukhinaha Sarve Santu Niramaya Sarve Bhadrani Pashyantu Ma Kachitukha Bhapave Om Shanti 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 Slowly rub your palms, generate heat. Cup it on your eyes and face. Feel the warmth, feel the energy. Now slowly looking through the gaps of the fingers, open your eyes with a beautiful smile.